Hey guys, how's it going? Um, obviously, I just did my workout, which I only did part of it because uh, I've got a call in 10 minutes. Do you see what I just did? Seriously? I'm like a child um, when I drink fast. My paleo black coffee with coconut oil. Added a little nutmeg this morning. Um, so there's nutmeg and cinnamon and coconut oil on there. Um, anyway, I got all dressed to go. I was going to go for a run and then uh, hit some weights when I came back here. I was going to do some um, ultimate sandbag maybe. And uh, then I was really pissed because, I don't know if you can tell, I'm kind of dressed to go outside. It's chilly in Chicago. And I've got my Under Armour bras on for running, which are the best um, for keeping these things in place. Um, but I was really pissed because I went to get my iPod and it was totally dead as far as batteries are concerned. I have to tell you, I'm, I find the way that you ch have to find ways to charge an iPod really annoying. I mean, when you get it, it doesn't even, it just comes with like a USB hookup, you know, and I'm one of those people that freaks out about charging my devices. Like I need my, I like this, when it's not here, it is plugged into my charger overnight, and then I get up in the morning and I put it in my Mophie, which gives me extra juice because I can't stand, like, oh, see right now? I'm only at 87% power, which freaks me out. I don't like being without power. So I go to put my freaking, you know, earbuds on, and I grab my iPod and it's like red light. And I'm thinking, and then I couldn't find my Moto Active. I don't know where I put that. I haven't found it since the move. So I had no music, and I'm sorry. I'm not going running. Some of you, excuse me, like to go running without music. I don't. Um, because there's times when I'm running where I'm like, I don't feel like it. And then if I just hit the next song, it'll get me going. Um, but I had to come in here and tell you a couple of things. Um, a lot of you guys have been asking me to hold this up for you. The blue stuff that I take in the morning. And here's the thing. Sometimes, as you can tell, I'm a little, um, I have shiny object syndrome. I get distracted easily. I get off track. Um, there are people that work with me that are always having to go, Kelly, focus, focus because I just like to do everything all at once and then sometimes I forget. So for me, getting in habits and routines is quite helpful. It would also be quite helpful to have somebody, maybe just, I don't want someone to live with me. Somebody that could just show up and make sure I do everything. Anyway, the thing is, the um, Genetics HD is a, is a whole line that I'm supposed to be taking from GNC. And the kind folks at GNC our client of Fitfluential, so let me please disclose that again. Um, so they sent me the whole line. Here's my problem. The way that, the ideal way to take this is you take, so this is the powder, okay? And I'm not even gonna try to explain the science behind this. It, it's aiding in fat loss. So some of you that have asked me on Instagram um, if you should be taking this, um, sorry, if you're already at like 18% body fat, you don't need to be taking this. I am in fat loss phase, so um, I am using this. <laughs> Sorry. I have a lot on my mind right now. I have to get downtown. I've got to get a shower. I've got meetings. I've got to make sure I'm doing everything. Um, so this is what you take in the morning. Um, I take this before my coffee. I take it before my breakfast. And I kind of like what I did this morning as far as when I did my workout. So I'm thinking I might adjust because I've told you guys a couple of times, if I go for a run or typically if I'm talking about anything that's like a cardio factor. And if I've eaten, I, I just do much better with an empty stomach. So right now the only thing I've had this morning, and I'm not, okay, don't get me wrong, I'm not trying to do one of those like, oh, well maybe if I don't eat in the morning I can have half the day and not eat. I'm not trying to do anything stupid like that. I'm just saying, I want to get my workouts done in the morning. Um, I'm more effective that way, and I'm also more effective if I'm doing anything high intensity, if I don't have anything in my stomach. The only thing that I've been able to do effectively is maybe before a run have like half a banana or a, a bite of a banana with some almond butter on it. Um, but I do take this first thing in the morning, okay? Then, of course, 
I didn't get my pills. Um, hold on, one second. So there's, um, this is the Pro Sculpt, which is the powder. Then there's the, I don't have my box with me. Um, the, uh, this is what you take at night with your dinner. Um, and then there's Pro Sculpt, uh, ugh, that's pissed me off. Anyway, there's um, a pill, there's three pills that has some caffeine in it that they say take, you know, before, I think before your workout is ideal. So ideally you would take this first thing in the morning, maybe do your workout a few hours later. Excuse me, you take those three pills before your workout. I chugged that water too fast. And then you take this with your meal at dinner. This does not have the, the caffeine or anything in it. Um, Cause I asked Kelly at GNC about that. Thing is the only thing that I have, I've kind of avoided taking all three of them because the only thing I seem to have trouble with is, and I think it's because of the whole empty stomach thing. If I take those three pills before my workout, I just, and I don't know if I need to leave more space, I might not do that second part. What I might do are these two. Technically, the three of them are supposed to work all together, um, but I think I might stick with these. And I'll put up a link to, you know, obviously that's gonna be some fish oil in there and what the other ones are. Um, but. I think that it's just happened several times that when I take the pills before my workout and it's on an empty stomach, I can like feel them. I, I just, I'm a slow digester. I don't even know if that's a word. But um, when I take them before my workout, I end up just, go, you know, it just doesn't make me feel good. So I think I might skip that part or I'm going to ask Kelly if I'm taking them wrong. Um, but anyway, all that to say, I feel really good. I just did part of this. Okay, so I was planning to go for a run, and then I'm like, I just had this thing going on where I'm like, I have not done a workout in my new house yet. And you know, at my old place, I go through phases. At my old place, I was only working out in my house, doing a lot of Val Waters workouts. Well, really, I've only been doing Valerie's workouts for a while. Bikini Body X, is that right? Bikini, Bikini Body Express. <laughs> I keep thinking of BBX. Bikini Body Express, Red Carpet Ready. Uh, no, I was doing Bikini Body Express, and then Action Hero Babe. She has a new workout coming out, I think October 1st, Hot in a Hurry. And her workouts are always awesome. They're just these really kick butt circuit blasts, which I've told you, every time I look at hers in the beginning, I've told her this, so she knows. I look at them and I'm like, that's not gonna be hard enough. Well, I only do that once in the beginning because then I know if you really do them the way she tells you to, without stopping and you know, back to back to back, it will, it will kick your ass and you will be on the floor. Um, but this one, Kathy, who, <laughs> if you've been watching my videos and um, reading my blog for a while, again, I'm sorry I, if you need me to recommend a therapist, but you know that I have been a huge fan of Kathy Friedrich for a while. I met her last year in person at Fit Blogging and she's gonna be there again. She's freaking awesome. I kid you not, you guys, out of probably any workout DVDs I have, she is just one of the top. I've always loved her. Um, in the early days, I loved the firm workouts. Those are the ones that first got me using weights. Um, I loved Insanity for a while. It's just, I don't, as you can tell, shiny object syndrome. I don't wanna do just Insanity. I, it's just not my thing. I don't wanna do just P90X. I wanna be able to get up that day and go, what do I feel like doing? You know, if that means old school Tybo, I feel like doing old school Tybo. I almost did that today, but this is one of Kathy's newer DVDs. And let me just tell you, I did 25 minutes of this. Shoot, I had to stop because I have this call coming up. But I don't know if you can see this, because sometimes it, when I do these videos, it shines and there's a reflection. All of Kathy's DVDs, um, they are more expensive than other ones. You know, you're not gonna pay 10 bucks for a Kathy workout, but they are so worth it because you know, the entire, if I did the entire workout, it's 55 minutes. Then there's a bonus core workout for 10 minutes, a bonus low impact cardio Tabata for four minutes and 40 seconds. Then, can you see this? She always does all these pre-mixes. So you're getting like 200 workouts in one. I, she's not paying me to say this, she's just a BFF. You know, there's a time saver, a low impact Tabata, Firewalker Tabata, Plyo Tabata, Plyo plus Firewalker Tabata, Triple Tabata, Fitness Blast plus Firewalker Tabata, Circuit Blast, Fitness Blast, Plyo Tabata Core, Less Impact, No Tabatas. And then there's a premix, which is Crossfire plus Core, Crossfire Extreme. 
Um, she always has the ability to mix and match. The always has premixes and always has time savers. So, you know, if you feel like working out and you're like, oh, I don't have an hour, uh, but I want to do legs, she'll have a legs mix. All of her videos are like that. They are so awesome. Now, what I did is I thought I was going to have time to do the whole workout, so I popped it in. I got to about 25 minutes, kicked my butt. So I can only imagine what the full is. I've never been disappointed with any of Kathy's workouts. I use, I don't use Kathy's, um, you know, bands. I've ordered her bands in the past, but I tend to use Valerie's. Um, so this comes with Val's, if you go to valslide.com or valslide, you can get this with her Val slides, and now it comes in pink, if you're so inclined. Um, I use these all the time. I take this with me when I travel and the valve slides and some exercise bands and my TRX and I've got the ability to do just about anything I want. Um, this was kicking my butt. I was totally sweaty, totally out of breath, a um, lot of a lot of like plyo, just non-stop back to back to back to back. So I'm excited to try the rest. I'm also excited that I got a workout in and I have two minutes until my call so I have to go. You guys have a great Friday. I'm heading downtown. Um, to the Anytime Fitness Convention. Um, speaking there tomorrow morning, going to be hanging with a couple of my Fitfluential crew, and you'll see pictures and video and blah, blah, blah. See you tomorrow.